another member of the 68 pitching staff, Daryl Patterson. I had some doubts about that, and I thought, well, I'll, I'll answer going, that. I'll be going back to uh, California pretty soon, and uh, no, we come back and uh, went back down there to St. Louis and scored 13 runs, I believe, in the sixth game, and then won the seventh game against one of the greatest pitchers of all time. Are you kidding me? And I go home in California, and the people back there tell me we're lucky? Uh-uh. No, we weren't lucky. We were good. Um, and re realize uh, the situation, you know, Big Earl uh, had pulled a muscle, and uh, so I came in, walking in by first base there. Guess who's playing first base but Al Kaline, and he's telling me, come on, Chief. Last time you saw Mickey Stanley, he was in the dugout. So you can imagine the, 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 uh, how high I was. I mean, I was jacked up big time. And uh, I was throwing the my, foot, my arm felt like it was ten foot long, and I was probably throwing as hard as I ever threw in my life. And you really can do something when you're scared, uh, but it, it 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 turned out to be a fantastic. I think I threw the the best pitch in my career that the three two pitch I made to end the in that inning, and uh, it was uh, it surprised me because I was way ahead of my delivery and I, I had to drop and drive and I, I kind of put my palm up and the ball, went, I looked up and the ball went right across the knees, right down the pipe and strike three and I thought, how in the hell did I do that? We got time for a